All right, I, there's an incredible event coming up to help senior citizens feel loved and appreciated. Connie Hamilton joins us now with a, a special organization that is delivering all this. First of all, what's the name of the organization? Senior Helpers. Senior Helpers. And we've got a different samples here of how people can get involved. All different kind of great messages for our seniors. And th the reason, <laughs> things like this or a special message for our seniors means so much more than it would for a normal person. Explain why. Well, it's huge because one in three seniors are feeling isolated. They don't have any contact with the outside community. Um, so this is a way that we can go into their homes, go into their communities and facilities and just show them a little love. And if they feel isolated, and, and here's where the link that I think is so important, even something simple like beautiful little message like this, mm -hmm. it can make their day. And those that feeling of isolation can mm -hmm. lead to illness, and it, illness can lead to early death. Absolutely. That's the big problem, right? Yeah, risk of heart attack, stroke, early dementia. So when you guys do this, you guys have all kinds of decoration stickers mm -hmm. for people to come. They can they can decorate. You can make a message. I wrote that right here. <laughs> Just a little thoughtfulness for them goes a long way. How can we get our families involved? How can we get the kids involved? to make the situation better in the future. Yeah, and that's a good point. It doesn't just have to be reliant on senior helpers or other right. senior related uh, companies, but getting your kids involved, you know, yeah. saying, hey, come, let's make some Valentines or let's, they we have extra create, dinner right? or something and go find your neighbor, go out there, find, we all know a senior or older person that probably lives alone um, and could use a little love and take them something and spend time with them. You guys have a website that I'm showing all the different things yeah. that you can do here. You can really get creative. I notice when I'm around uh, young kids and we do things like this, boy, they go to town love it. and they love to write messages and use their good handwriting and there's all kinds of fun stickers you can mm -hmm. use. So you really make it easy. You guys have a website that we can go to to help as well. Yeah, seniorhelpers.com. So as you're making cards for Valentine's Day, you can bring them to any of our local offices. Um, and we've had a huge community support, Napa Valley um, Support Services, Salvation Army in Turlock. Yeah. I, we're up to 16, 1700 cards right now really? that they've made. Um, so yeah, it's re it's huge. And then you deliver them on or before uh, Valentine's yep, Day? Yeah, we'll be doing it that Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. When you see their faces when they read this and they get something delivered, a lot of something tears. that's personal, mm -hmm. really? Yeah. And that's that's the whole point there. They feel appreciated. They feel like they're a valued member of our society. And that helps them health-wise. It helps them mentally. Absolutely. Yeah. Connie, thanks so much for joining us today. It is a simple Valentine for you and me, but for them, it means so much more, our senior citizens. Connie, thank you. Thank you. All right. Nine